Alright, welcome on back folks to another episode on Tales of Berseria. Picking up where we left off, we are about to go and look at these at three. At looking chest, we're gonna go see if we can't do some looting. I don't know, I don't remember what these are. This looks goofy. Oh no, I'm in so much trouble, so much trouble. Won't so Oh god, Polly's help a kitty out. Fuck. <laughs> oh look, another weirdo. That another talks. weirdo. <laughs> yes. Velvet agreed. Simmer down, big man. She's just a cat. Haven't mm -hmm. seen one in a good long while. Cats? Is that different from a regular cat somehow? It's complicated. Cats are a mysterious bunch. Just think of them as a special kind of Moloch. Sort of. Well, it works for me. I understand that they're hard to understand, at least. Hey, I don't suppose you happen to be carrying any cat spirits on you? They look like this. That's just like what I found at Titania. Perfect. You oh, could God. say they're kind of like our souls to us. Cat spirits, huh? Sometimes we call them kitten caboodles, too. That's just foolish. Kitten caboodles? Then how about kitty clumps? Oh, God. Anyway, <laughs> one night we were having a feast so meowful, our souls flew right out of our bodies. That's why I need your help to find the cat spirits and use them to emiosipate my friends. Emiosipate? Oh, my Emiosipate. God. Really? Yeah, that's what I'm thinking, dog. It means to use cat spirits to free cats who are locked away in cats boxes like these here. Meow. Here you'd say apesipate. <laughs> this one would be edoxipate. And finally... Whew. I'm free, meow. See? Emiosipate. By that logic... Shouldn't it be Ecatsipate? Wow, you're way more clever than you look! For real! I guess I totally underestimated you! Please, our cat spirits got scattered fur and wide, and so many sad cats are trapped He's got a fish him. on his tail. <laughs> it's got a fucking fish on his tail. Oh my god. <laughs> I just can't. Please, think of the cats! You know... Cats have weird and mysterious powers. There's a good chance we might benefit by having them in our debt. We'll make it worth your while, I promise. And if we snub them, they might put a curse on us. That has been known to happen. You. <laughs> if we're doing all this traveling anyway, why not help them on the side? Just remember that it's on the side. Exactly. Cat spirits. These essence drifting through the world are like souls to the cat people. You can collect them simply by touching them. You will need these spirits to open the cat's boxes found around the world. These special treasure chests can be opened with cat spirits you've gathered. Opening a cat's box will free the cats trapped inside, some of whom will give you a gift of catitude. I mean gratitude. I mean, you guys are just having too much fun with that. Having way, way too much fun with that. It, it, it was a little funny, but it was it. It did uh, it did get uh, old pretty quick. <laughs> do 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 do. Oh, I was trying to look at the world map. Exorcists. Well, that's just inconsiderate. Word of the prison break couldn't have traveled so quickly. I somehow doubt they'll just let us in looking the way we do. I... I... apologize... about earlier. I didn't mean to steal this. The compass. You okay with this? He could be working for the exorcists. I'm following him. Hmm. Is he your dessert? If necessary. Oh. Is he your dessert? If necessary. Ooh. 
Ooh. This, like rosemary or sage? I need to use. Oh, rude. Shut up. You guys are telling me what to do. I'm just uh, I'm just out here living my best life. Just trying to explore and find some loot and goodies and stuff, you know? I mean, I've been picking that up. Also known as Melchionite, a rare mineral only found in Northgand. Mix it with sulfur and you get explosives. Mix it with oil and you get fuel. Sounds dangerous, if it's true. Believe me or not, it's your call. Looks like the boy got away. Well, we're in the city now. Well, then let's scout for the Maritime Guild. Whoever's in charge of all these storehouses must have their hands in the shipping trade and shipbuilding. And we could use a true sailor if we can find one. Now that's a plan I endorse. We dodged the sea's murderous grasp this time, but who's to say our luck will hold? We should look for some weapons too, if I'm to be any use in a fight. You're still wearing one. Nope, not an option. That is strictly or cosmetics he paid an extra 99 cents to get that that sword on his back he's not using it Reduces damage from fire based attacks. Okay. Cool. I'm still working on mastering this, so I'm not too worried about that one. are working so hard that we look up to them. Yeah! Exorcists are the best! <laughs> They're treated like heroes. I suppose <laughs> normal people, they are. Exorcists are the best! It's, it's X or X. X or X. Okay. <laughs> you, you'll get it when you get older, kid. You'll, you'll be able to uh, ex uh, like say the word properly. Uh, I don't want to go down here. It's still here. <laughs> Warp. Anything down here? I see some items. Ooh. 
Hey, look at that. Safe point. Midas. What's in here? Absolutely nothing. Oh shoot, I missed that though. Increases attack by two, raising martial and hidden art damage. Ooh. Oh, let's go through and use some of this. Uh, yes. Wasn't there more than just those two? Oh, that's new. I'm taking all the buffs for myself. Well, I mean, I'm the only one in the party right now. There's a chest at the end of the road. End of the path. What is this? Blood blade. Is it is it better than the current blood blade I have? HP recovery on defeating foes plus 30. Same thing, but it gives me max HP. This is crazy. We are level 7 and we already have 900, 900 HP. Um, see if this takes me to anywhere special. See an item. Amber garment. HP. It was 9:32. Like, and we get a thousand HP before we leave the first town. What that other ladder that was back here? Oh man, it feels so good to be playing this. I'm like, really excited. Oh, this is back where I started. Cool. Do, 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 We're gonna run right past the objective and check on the other side. Do, do, no! There's you son of a bitch! <laughs> is that the guild? Oh, hey, that weapon shop looks promising. Good luck with the shipwright search. Boys, poor creatures just can't be separated from their favorite toys, can they? I mean, can you? It's true. Can you be separated from your favorite toy? Probably not. And I just thought about this. That sounds nasty. <laughs> sounds very bad. <laughs> Is this a shipping guild? Damn that dial! What does he think he's doing by trying to resist? We wouldn't be in this mess if he were dead. Excuse me. We need a ship repaired. Sorry, but we can't help. What makes you say that? Guild business is currently suspended. By the order of Exorcist Teresa of the Abbey. Lady Teresa. Number two, did I give you permission to speak? Uh. That was rude. Lady Teresa, how long must this punishment of ours last? 
You know it was all Dial's fault, don't you, my lady? I know Dial was the one smuggling Flamestone, but your guild, through its negligence, shares responsibility. This rule was set down by the Abbey to maintain order. Do you disagree with it? No, my lady. Yes. We will capture, interrogate, and sentence Dial. When this has been accomplished, you will be free to continue business. And you, girl, aren't you cold dressed like that? Why do you care? I've just arrived from the south. I wasn't aware Northgown was so cold. Hutch! A young woman ought to keep herself warm. Thank you for your concern. I'll whoop your ass later. the abbey flexes its muscle hmm cruel cruel world these days i see how things stand if i catch this dial person you can repair my ship right sure but i warn you he's a demon he escaped after killing a bunch of soldiers who tried to capture him can't be done without an exorcist oh yeah it can he's from a small village outside the city if you're doing this i'd imagine that's a good place to start searching He's a brute with the head of a lizard. I'd prepare for bloodshed. Mm. Hey. Anything could happen. It's best to keep our options open. While you wait, find us a good navigator. Damn, Miss Percy. I wonder what darling Rokoro's got up to in the meantime. Let's oh, check let's in go. on him at the weapon shop. Uh, okay, so he's there. Well, I want to go the other places instead. Also, if you speak to him. Okay, that's, 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 that's cool. You don't have to worry about getting attacked by demon. This town is under the protection of the... Wow. She must really She is. She's lost. She's as cool as ice and as pure and dazzling. Our town is as beautiful and pristine as it is because we have Lady Teresa here. Anyone who disturbs her order, whether human or demon, will be Sounds just like an exorcist. The way she glares at the filthy. Oh, if oh my she God. would look at me like that with those ice cold eyes. If She's she getting off. Looks like him run around loose, then I'm sure she He was getting off. He's like, oh, oh, he's called gaze. Oh, bro, bro, like you're you're at, you're at like 15. We need you to come back down to like five. Like simmer the fuck down. This looks like an inn. Because it is, it is an inn. I didn't even really look. Hold on. Let me go back in. I want to look upstairs. Oh, hold on. If I talk to these guys, do the green dots go away? I'm just kind of curious. No, oh, they still they stay there. Okay. Uh, 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 uh. Appa, yep, yep. Found a real good one. The blade was badly rusted, but once I polished it up, it turned out to have a fine edge. 
I can scarcely believe something of that quality was languishing in my bargain bin. You've taught me quite a lesson. The weapon is yours as payment. My thanks. So you'll help us out? Of course. How did your errand fare? I see. So we're hunting a reptilian demon called Dial, are we? We'll check out his hometown first. Have fun, you kids! You aren't coming along? I'm afraid I've got bigger fish to fry at the moment. That little matter of tracking down my betrayer. Besides, if I stick around, I'm not so sure I wouldn't wind up as someone's midnight snack. My pellet has standards. High standards. All the more reason to skedaddle! Yeah. Ooh, I do have money. Okay, so I can hold up to 15, okay. Okay, so let's more attack. More defense, more art defense. Attack, defense, focus. Attack, defense. Attack, defense, focus. Attack, defense. Art defense. Right? Or no, art. Yeah, no, art. Yeah, right. Art defense. I thought it was the wizard hat that was art defense, and then the staff that's the art attack. Oof. Oh, I need to look at his stats, too. You know, okay, he can't run any of this. I'll put his attack up. And you can't use items reduced. Ooh. My ring, I already have one. It has art attack, though. So now that he's in the party. I was wondering where I got the other one from. Oh well, he's... I just opened up a bunch of uh conversations. Look, a yak. Hey Velvet, here's a fun fact. Yak tail hair is considered to be among the highest quality materials for a helmet's plume. Wow, really? Also, I don't care. At my house, we had this helmet. It was an incredible piece, covered with yak tail hair. The talk of the town. House Rangetsu has two treasures going for it, people would say. The helm of yak and storm howl. They must not have thought very highly of the rest of you. Hmm? Why do you say that? Although, I guess I can think of a reason or two. Oh well, it's nothing a demon like me has to worry about. <laughs> Rangatsu, huh? Did you hear? That navigator for the shipping guild, Dial. He turned into a demon. He supposedly killed and ate his crewmates, then ran off. Demon Blight? In Hell of Ease? What do we do? No need to worry. Lady Teresa is already dealing with it. She'll hunt down that Dial character in no time. They say that once you change, you can never turn back into a human. Is killing him our only option? Killing him would be a mercy. No, Demons there's... Monsters there, we're we're, we're gonna... Humanity. Well... Yeah, you're right. We're gonna eat him. Things like that aren't <laughs> human anymore. Not human, huh? Yeah, well... It's not always fun being human, you know? Saying I'm not human. Here's the other conversation. Let me get this straight, Alpha Area. You want to form an alliance with my Gamma Area to bring down the Betas? Correct. It's the classic strategy. Let's have a snowball fight right with here. A distant state and strike a neighboring one. What is this? A council of war? The enemy of my enemy is my friend. Is that it? 
Indeed, if your Alpha Forces and my Gamma Forces work together, Beta Area is done for. <laughs> I like it. You've got yourself an Alliance Alpha Area. Excellent! We shall be victorious in this year's Hell of E's Grand Snowball Fight! Let us toast to our victory! This isn't a snowball fight, it's a snowball war. <laughs> Fools! I was the one who engineered their alliance! Once they eliminate Beta Area, the Alpha and Gamma forces will launch a full-scale assault to destroy the other. Exhausted, the victor won't be prepared when my Delta army sweeps down upon them. They have sealed their own doom. These kids really fight dirty. All spare in snow and war. What the hell? This cold is beyond ordinary. Well, Halavis is a northern country. The cold, snow, and ice. It's that. What do they call it again? Global cooling? Yeah, that's the one. The Abbey. Thanks to all this cold, I need more warm clothes. Ugh. Who's responsible? For well, don't look at me. Don't look at me, it's not my fault. Okay, we have another conversation back this way and then to our left. So this episode will more than likely just be the based on this little town area where we, where we at Heloise. And then the next episode will continue on with what we were doing. What a beautiful ship. Isn't she? With she a dial or whatever it is. Sulfur to the capital in Midgand. Have you heard of Flamestone? It's this new explosive material the Abbey developed. Thanks to their discovery, we can make some really powerful new cannons and explosives. Explosives. Sounds dangerous. It is dangerous, but it's on the bright side. With a higher demand for flamestone, flamestone is the only reason our little snowbound city is thriving. So this ship goes to the capital. If I asked... Nope, not happening. The guild ordered a total suspension of activity. Besides, any ship carrying precious ores has an exorcist on board for security. Sounds like they keep a tight lid on... Yeah, I guess. But the Abbey makes the rules, so what are you gonna do? Without the Abbey, humanity would be dead in the water. Okay. All right, so... I did Dial's home village. So... Do we need to take the back entrance still, or can we go back and take the other entrance? I don't know, this one's closer, so we're just gonna stick with this one. There's another conversation up there. and snow as far as the eye can see are you cold i'm fine but i'm not the one with the exposed midriff doesn't bother me either and watch where you let your eyes wander hey there sorry i, I meant no offense hmm so you still retain feelings like shame then wait you don't me i've lost a lot of my human feelings i figured that was just part of turning into a demon i didn't know that but deep down i'm still the same person i always was and I can still enjoy a good drink. I'm glad I haven't lost that, at least. If you say so. Okay. Um, ba -ba 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 -ba. Let's head. Uh, what are we at? We're at 29 minutes. We're, we're going to go ahead and wrap this episode on up. And in the next one, we will go for that other conversation. And then go check out Dial's home. So thanks for tuning in, guys. I will catch you all in the next one.